Hey guys, it's Joy. Hey, I was tagged by Nurse Dawn to do a video on that pivotal homeschool moment when you realized you were gonna move forward with homeschooling your kids. Um, mine has been a journey of probably like most people's, but I actually have always known what homeschooling was and have been familiar with it because I was actually homeschooled kindergarten through fourth grade. Um, it was in the 80s, not a lot of people knew what it was, and I grew up in a very small town, and we were about the only family in that town that did that. Um, I have an older sister who's about six, five and a half years older than me, six years older than me, and she was homeschooled for a little portion of that, but not all of it. So I was mostly home by myself, and we went to a smaller church, so there were not a lot of kids my age around that I had for friends. So I am a very extroverted person and I like to be around people. I like to have a lot of friends and I like that kind of thing. So my experience being homeschooled growing up, I I would have loved it had it not been for not having a lot of kids around, um, if that makes sense. So therefore, when I had my own children and my mom had asked me, hey, have you thought about homeschooling? I, it got me to thinking about it and I thought, you know, I don't know. And when you're holding a little bitty baby, you think you have all the time in the world to decide that. But three years goes by really quickly and then all of a sudden your friends are, are talking about preschool and you think, okay, well, you know, and I was thinking, you know what, homeschooling for preschool sounds really fun. Like, and I still, to this day, it's the most fun for me. I love teaching preschoolers. So I would say that that was kind of um, how we eased ourselves into it. And I just thought, I'll just do it for preschool and then we'll take one year at a time. And one night I remember sitting down with my husband and saying, hey, you know, I know you're okay with preschool, homeschooling. What do you think about past that? And much to my surprise, he was 100% on board. He did not grow up around any homeschoolers, but he was 100% on board. And so I was, that motivated me. And then of course, you know, with that kind of support, I was like, <clears throat> of course, why wouldn't I try this? So I um, found classical conversations right before my oldest, who is now eight, was going into kindergarten. So three years ago, um, I found classical conversations, and that's a whole nother video about classical education and classical conversations and why we like that. But as far as getting into homeschooling, that's it, I just kind of decided, oh, sure, I'll do it for preschool. And then it just fell into place for me. I found classical conversations, and it just, I don't know, it all kind of just started clicking for me after that. And I won't say that it's easy for me now. It is the farthest thing from easy but it is like my heart's desire now and I know it's my husband's heart's desire and so that spurs me on and it really um, I see so many benefits and um, we actually live right by a public school so I have no problem with public school I grew up in it and I mean you know there's good and bad things that go on but same as at home, I mean, there's good things and there's also, you know, bad attitudes and bad things as well. So anyways, um, that is my kind of journey for homeschooling. And that was the reason I kind of started. It wasn't like a hard and fast, like, yes, I'm all in, I'm going to do this. But I do remember saying to my husband last year, I said, you know what? It is right now my heart's desire to go all the way through high school. I said, that may change, but I said, right now, that is my desire. I would love, love, love to do that. So that is how our homeschooling journey has looked and so far, and um, we're kind of newbies at it still, I feel like, but that is, yeah, that's our journey so far. So thanks so much, Nurse Dawn, for tagging me, and I hope you guys have a great day.